Uh, yeah, I was really happy. I woke up in the morning and it was like the first thing I did. You know? and, uh, and I ran upstairs and I told my flatmates. So I was pretty excited, to be honest, because it was a bit of a tight race. If we had had a Republican president maybe moved into power, things would have changed maybe too rapidly and the course of the change that Obama was trying to do maybe would have created too much of too much chaos. I guess I'm a bit more happy that Mitt Romney lost, to be honest. Um, I think it shows that, that Americans aren't ready for that kind of extremism, um, which is really good because sometimes you get lost in it. You watch Fox News and you get really afraid for you know, how people are becoming and growing. And it's scary. So I'm glad he lost. And I do think that it's a bit of a shame that everybody, like all the Americans, they criticize Obama for not having done enough for America, and there hasn't been enough change in the situation in the United States. But I mean, you have to give him some kind of credit with the situation that America was in before he was elected. It's kind of difficult to recover from something like that in just four years. They're, they're also a representative of what we are, you know, in the international scheme. So with Romney, it's just, you know, so many people in the world really love Obama and maybe they don't understand fully what, it, what it's all about, but we did see a lot of positive change in the perspectives of people throughout the world when, when Obama came in at first. And I think maybe it's a little bit less than the first time, but the momentum is still there. Can you teach me how to play basketball? Yeah, yeah, TV yeah. It's very good. Yeah.